much in that pot, so we're gonna take some out of it. You only want about that much paint in your pot. Why? If you need more paint than that, it's gonna saturate your brush, and then you're gonna have a heck of a time cleaning that thing, not to mention. When you kick it back like that, towards the back, you wanna watch when you do that, because it might pop out this way. And take your brush, and wipe that excess off there, so it's not just dribbling down. I said this one might have a little too much paint in it. Mm -hmm. So what you can do is just pour a little bit back in there. Same thing here. Wipe that edge. That way it's not just dripping down. You're walking around over top of stuff and it's just tripping all over the place, getting all over you. When you're loading your brush up, what you're gonna do, you put it in there and slap it on the edges to load your brush. Yeah. Just slap it around. And you don't need any more paint than that on the end of it than that. Don't dip your whole brush you down in there. You don't just dunk it in there and have it all the way up to the stock here. All it's going to do is just create a big mess. It'll be all of your brush and your hand and yeah. your clothes. And for the most part, you should be able to just pop it back and forth and keep it from dribbling. See, if you come up like that, it's just a big mess. You yeah. pop it back and forth, and it's good. If you're raking your brush, try to do it in one spot continually. That way you have somewhere when you put your brush down, to lay it over like that. You have this a clean side you, on this one side here. Yeah, this will prevent you from getting paint all over your handle, all over your hands. Once it gets on your hands, you're transferring it everywhere else on the job site. So this is a way to keep clean, keep you clean. So always keep a wet rag with you whenever you're running some outside stuff. Because it's, it's very easy to get paint all over your hands. And the first thing you're gonna want to do is wipe your hands on your pants. Don't do not wipe your hands on your pants. You, they make rags for that. Your pants are expensive. You, after you do two or three jobs of wiping your hands all over your pants, your pants don't look very good. You don't look like a very clean painter.